There's a hidden message in the text. Shepherdess, no temptation that Poussin Teniers hold the key. Peace, 681, by the cross and this horse of God, I complete this demon guardian at midday. Or to the meridian, blue apples. I think I'll write that cipher down. Zion. These parchments must be linked to the Priory somehow. The British gals have been eating again. What do you care anyway? You said you weren't interested. I'm not. That doesn't mean I care to watch you belly up to the trough. Besides, you're just setting yourself up for a fall. Gracie doesn't like you that way. Oh? And what kind of guy would she like? I don't know. Younger, maybe? Good looking? A nice guy? She deserves a nice guy. Which explains her alleged attraction to you. Oh, that's purely chemical. Poor kid. See, I've got this pheromone thing going on. Yeah, I tried not bathing myself once, but my co-workers got a little upset about it. Oh, ha, ha, ha. You never could stand my success with women. No, it was how you screwed with women that I couldn't stand. Ah, back off, Lancelot. Yeah, I guess we better talk about something else before I get worked up. Hello, boys. Oh, uh, Madeline. <laughs> hey. Oh, you are already dining. How disappointing. I was hoping to spend some time with you. And especially with you, Gabriel. Well, we can make room. But I must change. The night is just beginning. Will I see you when I come down? Wouldn't miss it. Sure. Then I will be extra quick. A bientôt. Man, is she hot for you! Whew. Where'd that come from? Pheromones. Christ. You gonna go for it? Why not? Sex worked for Bond. But Grace is in your room. Yeah, what did I tell you? Having her around is like wearing a freaking chastity belt. But Madeline doesn't have a roommate. <laughs> well, go for it, I guess. But Kaylee's dining early. Good evening, Signore Bukele. And to you, Miss Nakimura. Have you quite recovered from this afternoon? See, si. with a little help from the vine. <laughs> I don't know what I'd say to him after what I just heard. Good evening, Mademoiselle Nakimura. 
Jean told me you are staying in room 25 with Monsieur Knight. I bet he did. I am uh, Simone, mademoiselle. I hope you will enjoy your visit. <laughs> Thanks. Have you seen anything, um, oh, I don't know, uh, curious around town lately? Ah, oui, mademoiselle. What? Someone has bought a chicken. It is making my mother crazy, this chicken. It comes to the garden, it eats her seeds. I do not know who is the owner of this chicken, but I know my mother. This chicken will be in the soup pot one night. Oh, uh, well, it happens to the best of us. Do you know anything about the treasure, Simone? Well, I have seen many treasure seekers come and go, mademoiselle, but I have never thought much of the idea myself. But there is a museum if... Yeah, I know. Thanks anyway. Oh my god! It's a copy of Le Serpent Rouge! There is a fingerprint on it. This riddle is fascinating. You can almost see what it's hinting at. I really want to solve it. Now, there's no point in scanning Le Serpent Rouge. I'll have to interpret the verses myself. Sydney isn't that smart. Working. Whoever's print that is, we don't have them in the database yet. I guess I'll try again later, when we've got more prints. I lay down the path of Ra and was illuminated. What's the path of Ra? Maybe I should try a search and see what Sydney has to say about Ra. In my arduous search, I was trying to hack away with my sword through the dense vegetation of the woods like some pawn of destiny. I wanted to reach the place of the sleeping beauty in which some poets can see the queen of a lost kingdom. 
Desperate to find the way, I laid down the path of Ra and was illuminated. Sunrise line, on the feast day of St. Mary Magdalene, ah, I wonder if that's the path of Ra. Hello, Abbe Arno? Come in. Miss Nakimura, good evening. Hi, I was looking around town tonight. It's a beautiful church. Thank you. Please sit down. I was reading about the Magdalene statue in the church pamphlet. Interesting, isn't it? All four of the Magdalene statues still exist. So, were they related to the local Magdalene cult? It is possible, but Magdalene has not been represented with a skull anywhere else in the Long Dog. Besides, Saunier placed that statue so prominently, some believe that everything he did in the church relates to the treasure somehow. The church pamphlet talks about a sunrise line on July 22nd. Does that really happen? Oh yes! If you stand at the church and look east, the sun rises directly over Chateau de Blanchefort. Was that intentional, do you think? Mademoiselle, but of course! But that would mean someone had to choose the location of Blanchefort quite deliberately. It is younger than the church, isn't it? But you see, Blanchefort and the church were built on far older ruins. Have you considered the church site, too, may have been positioned deliberately? It would not be the first time the ancients played with light and astronomy. Look at Stonehenge or the Great Pyramids. Hmm. Do you think there's a buried treasure around here? I know there is, my child. Is he a friend of yours? Oh yes, I have the privilege to know him. He is Francois, the present Duke of Lorraine. Do you know the family? I've heard of it. Well, naturally. I better get going. Thanks, Abbe Arno. It's a pleasure to be of service, mademoiselle. Oh, no. No. No thanks. I was raised Buddhist. We believe in karma. Getting rid of your guilt isn't quite so easy. Emilio looks like he's recovered. How are you feeling, Mr. Baza? Oh, much better, thank you. It was quite a shock, wasn't it? What was? Um, the two dead men? The two? Oh, of course. Yes, it really was a shock. Are you quite all right, Miss Nakamura? You know, you're the first person who's asked me that. Sometimes it is easier for a stranger to be polite than a friend. But don't let me keep you. 
I'm sure you have better things to do. Very cool. I was further aided by the parchments of my friend. They murmur of the lady. Long ago, her name was Isis, queen of the benevolent springs. Come to me, all you who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Others knew her as Magdalene with the celebrated vows of healing balm. The initiated knew her to be the Lady of the Lake and Notre Dame de Cross. The circle is the ring and the crown forms the diadem of the Queen of the Castle. There are four statues of Magdalene with the skull and four names for Magdalene given in Pisces. Isis, Magdalene Lady of the Lake, and Notre Dame de Cross. And the part about the circle, the circle forms the ring, it must be talking about locating the treasure geographically. Maybe there's some circle around here. See, there are four statues and four names for Magdalene in Pisces. I have a feeling those statues are important, but is it the statues themselves or their location that matters? It's Magdalene's crown. I'll write those coordinates down. It looks like they're at L'Hermitage. I'm ready. Does anyone want to go out? We could drive to the bar at like Grand Le Bain. Sure. What about Grace? Oh, she's busy with her research. She'll be in the room for... Oh, 
Hey, Grace. Um, want to go to Renly Bant with us? No, thank you. See, told ya. Ugh, maybe I'll hang out too. Uh-uh, we need you, right, Madeline? Of course. Do come with us, please. Uh, all right. Grace, uh, see ya. Don't work too hard. Get some dinner. Mm-hmm. Oh, you bet. Jerk. Buona notte, signor Ivaza. Good evening. Would you care for some wine? Uh, no, no, thank you. I may have some water in a bit. At least Bukele has Emilio to keep him company. They still look a little shook up from this afternoon. How are you feeling, Lady Howard? Better, I hope. Oh, don't remind me. Such horrors! One takes a vacation for ease, for comfort. What does one find? Horrors! Don't think about it, Lily. I'm sorry. Um, how's dinner? The tomato sauce smells divine. Oh, oh! I do believe I'll be ill. Lily, please. Have some water, there's a good girl. Thank you for stopping by, Miss Nakamura. Sure. Sorry. Bye. Queen's Guard is the Quaternity, they who stand watch over the Guardian. I look to the north and the west, then the south and the east, and everywhere I see them, their shining swords held out to meet each other. Saint Michael and his brothers, with their feet rooted in the earth, they surround the IS that none may harm her, and stand pressed against her in a way that Pythagoras would have approved. Okay, the Queen is the circle, I think. Her guard is the Quaternity. North, west, south, then east. Those are directions, so something is surrounding her. St. Michael and his brothers. Hmm. We're supposed to square the circle on the map. But how? A tilted square represents the light along with the circle. That must be the part about the cat reflects the light in harmony with their queen. So we're looking for a tilted square. I'm sure that square is the right size, but I'm not sure what angle it's at in relation to the meridian. Maybe Taurus can help.
In the sanctuary is the font, fountain of love of those who believe, reminding us of these words, by this sign you will conquer. I understand this now. The four are the stuff of the alchemist's laboratory, and their cant reflects the light in harmony with their queen. And yet the angels hold tight the secret of the angle that is the key to the kingdom. My friend knows the secret, but wisely he hides the fruit among the chaff that the treasure not be lost to the infidels. How do I tilt the square? It says, my friend knows the secret, but wisely hides the fruit among the chaff. Who's my friend? Is it talking about the parchments again? I'm simply not up for another boring night in our room. I mean, I realize this is not the Riviera, but surely something can be done. A little quiet would be good for you after today's excitement. And we can go over the... No, no, not that. My brain hurts already. I say there, Signore Bucchelli. Are you up for bridge? Con molto piacere. It would be a pleasure. Now what about a fourth? You there, miss... Oh, bother. It's... it's Grace. Of course it is. Won't you join us a bridge, Grace? Oh, no. No, no, thank you. Uh, why don't you ask... What about Mr. Wilkes? Where is Mr. Wilkes? I was just wondering that myself, Signora. I haven't seen him since he left the hotel this afternoon. What a bother. How unsociable people are these days. No manners whatsoever. <sighs> I say, Mr. Barza, would you join us? I would be happy to oblige. Not a single print. Now, isn't that odd? Sunrise Line. On the feast day of St. Mary Magdalene, uh, I wonder if that's the path of Ra. I bet this is the statue Taurus mentions. Hmm. Those angels' gestures might not be what they appear. Let me see if I can figure it out. It's a tilted square. I bet this is the statue Taurus mentions.
Taurus says, my friend hides the fruit among the chaff. If the blue apples bit is the fruit, perhaps the piece 681 by the cross and this horse of God part is the chaff. In other words, a red herring. So, I complete this spirit guardian, okay, that must be the square, at midday or to the meridian, blue apples. Blue apples? That's what the old lady at Chateau de Serra said to me. She meant grapes. Could blue apples be referring to vineyards? Sarah's itself? To the meridian blue apples. In other words, to the meridian from the vineyard. Yes, that must be it. The mosaic tiles of the sacred place alternate black or white, and Jesus, like Asmodeus, observes their alignment. I can find 64 stones of the perfect cube which the knights of the beauty of the black wood had scattered when they fled from the white fort while they were being pursued by the usurpers. Reassemble the scattered stones and, working with square and compass, put them into ranks. The knightly order of the perfect cube fits within and gives structure to Our Lady's protector, the Heavenly Quartet. The tiles alternate black and white. Where have I seen that? 64 squares of the perfect cube. 64 squares. Well, it mentions ninth several times. Perhaps I should look it up. Knights, pawns, queens, rooks, they're all mentioned in the Serpent Rouge. The 64 stones must be a chessboard. That's it! That's the chessboard. Way to go, kid. Hey, Gailey. You seen Madeline? Of course. She's under my bed. Huh? Ah, you're being smart, are you? Well, I just thought she might be with that fellow of yours. This is his room too, ain't it? Yes. Say. So, since Madeline's not around, you want to have dinner with me? Uh, no. Oh, come on. I got some celebrating to do. Hey, I'm going to be a rich man after what I've found today. You play your cards right, you might learn something. 
All right. I'll change and meet you downstairs. Really? Good, I'll, uh... Quit it! Knock it off! Is this it? Just like I said, right? You said you'd explain it to me. I just don't understand all these technical things. Shouldn't have got me so damn drunk, then. <clears throat> oh, come on. I'm dying to hear your theory. Now, you, uh... uh you said this was taken by satellite? Damn right. Seisma... Um, uh, sisma... Um... Seismologists. Them. Right. They use radar to take satellite pictures all the time. Shows them underground forts and whatnot. No one ever thought to take one here, though, right? So when I sees one of these maps, I says to myself, John, I says, that's the ticket. And I was right, too, huh? <laughs> oh, so the radar bounces off the Earth and the echo is recorded. What? I mean, I guess. <laughs> right, right. So I pays to get one of these pictures done. And baby, I hit the jackpot. What's this dark area here? I hit the jackpot. What's this dark area here? A big old hollow. What you think? Caves, right? But all connected. A huge mother. So you think this is where the treasure is? Nah, baby. The treasure's right here. Oh! Chica! Oh! Hi, um, I just got back and I was trying to, uh, what are you doing with Wilkes, Grace? None of your business. And, uh, don't wait up. I'm sure Mosley's back too and we do have that catching up to do. Uh -huh.